Now what I have seen is I tried to make a video to show you how to fix the different cables of the motors and together with the controller box here. So what you are seeing now is all of the you know the electrical elements inside the controller box. And this one is a PLC, right? You you know we made of the Siemens. This PLC is made of a Siemens brand, like this. Uh, this one is Siemens, right? This one. CPU. You see the CPU? And Siemens, right? Thank you. And uh, you see here, this this one. This line, you see, it's very big, right? Big size, this one. Uh, big size. This one is for the, the main power of the electrical electrical uh, source, right? So, uh, there are three, right? Is uh, Because it's three feet. Three lines, three, three lines. We are connected here. We are connected here. Okay? This switch is the... Is the is the start is the start is the end of the electric uh, source. So this one, the power source the cable will be fixed here, so one by one, right? Okay, this one. And uh, I want to show you the different motors of the line. So what's next? You have to do is. Uh, and uh, what you have to connect is. Uh, the the different cable from the different motor okay so like this line uh, and this line this cable and this cable uh there are two cable you know we have uh, two vibrator. Uh, there's two vibration motor. This one, the vibration motor, right? This one, left side, and on the right side, uh, the right side, there's uh, another vibration motor. So this two vibration motor, the cable, will be connected here, right? And this cable is from the uh, the right the right motor right vibration motor, and this one, this cable this cable is coming from the left vibration table uh, motor. So we can connect it together, right? So here, and uh, uh, before delivery, and before delivery uh, delivery, we will make a mark on the line on the line like this. Like this, like this one. You know, here. You know, for each mo uh, for each motor, there will be three, three location for the connecting, for the connection. For each motor, there will be three location for connection. So that that means uh, for one one uh, one motor connection, there will be the U one, V one, and W one, right? So before delivery, we will uh, make a mark here. On each line, on each line, like this one, we will do uh, the, the white, uh, you know, this white circle. We will mark number like U one and uh, V one, W one. Uh, maybe here, right? So we will mark the here. This one is U one. This one is V one. This one W one. So you will find each each number and find out uh, here U one, V one, W one. You will connect here, right? So it's very easy, okay. And uh, this keyboard, and this keyboard, U uh, two V two, oh, and uh, this keyboard is coming from uh, here. It's coming from this this uh, this motor. This motor, this motor is for uh, mixing and spreading material. Mixing and spreading material. Uh huh. So this motor cable will be connected here. Will be here. So also the same, same. Also the same. We will mark the here, mark the this one like a, a U three and V three and U three, right? And V three and W three. 
you will you just find out the mark on the wine and get uh, and find out the same same uh, correct location here so you connect uh, each one right each one okay that will be easy uh, and uh, the fourth motor is uh, is this motor <coughs> is this motor and this motor is uh, to supply the power to uh, to push the material cut, material fitting cut in forward and back, this motor. This motor is to give the power to move the material fitting cut forward and back, this motor, right? So this motor people... is see, is this one. So this one, we will also mark here, and you find out, you know, the U5, V5, and W5, right? This one, okay? And another motor is this motor. For offloading the hook, you know the motor here, right? And you know the head mode, right? This head mode, this head mode is lift, is hold, is hold by this hook, by this hook. So that means uh, the time you plan to let the head mode drop down, so you have to let switch on this motor, this motor, right? This motor. Uh -huh. So this motor, the cable, you will find out also the same time, right? Same number, same number. And U6, V6, and W6, right? U6, W6, and uh, v V6 here, right? Uh, and the next motor is uh, is here. Next motor is here. And this motor is a little difficult to find out. And this motor, as you know, that down the, it's under the pallet feeder system. This motor is under the pallet feeder system. It's, uh, this motor is the function is to supply the power to push, to push, to feeding, to feeding, to feed the pallets in uh, forward, forward and back, right? So this motor. I can't wait to try. Okay. And this motor, the cable. Motor's cable also will be here, so you will connect the keep the, the wine to U7, V7, and W7. Okay, same same. It's very easy because we will mark here. We will mark the number here for the different uh, wines. And the last uh, and the last location is for what? Is for is for the for the motor for the transfer the blocks here. Is this motor? And this motor, this motor will be transferred the blocks after for me. Will be transferred out the blocks with the pallets and transfer to the stack machine to this motor. And this motor, and will be connected uh, here. U8, V8, and W8. So it's very easy, right? And uh, and what to what what's next? To, uh, what next? Next to do, and uh, next, uh, and the next one you have to do is uh, this one, uh, this one, right? This one. This cable. This uh, this chart, this chart, this chart head, is coming from the sensor. Okay, the sensor is coming from here. This line, this cable. So normally here you no need to do any adjustment, ad adjustment. So before delivery, we will fix everything here. So this controller box, uh, normally you don't need to do any to do anything on it about it, right? Okay. This cable, you see this cable. This cable is here. Is it charged? 
and try to remember try to remember this you know this there's a different uh, this one is the white one this one narrow one so narrow one will be at the down direction the white one will be up direction so use this direction and to chart it okay to chart it and use here to lock it that's all that's all and uh, you know the sensor here the sensor now what do you see i will show you the sensors from casing different sensors from casing here so like this this sensor this sensor right here is to control the board the, the mode box uh, down location that means uh, when the mode box touch this sensor the mode box will not go down anymore okay and this sensor you know all of the sensor we will fix uh, all of the things that we will fix uh, onto the block machine so you no need to change it you no need to change it so this thing is here that means uh, after the head mode is lift up after the head mode is lift up and uh, they will do a recycle and we will drop down to here after this ion uh, from the top top location and drop down to this location after this ion touch this sensor and the the mode box will be dropped down will be dropped down and after the motor box drop down and touch this uh, this sensor so the motor box will be stopped and uh, by that time by that time by that time the material feed system will be uh, you know to go go front go front to feeding and spreading the material inside the motor box and uh, here and here is this sensor is uh, is to control the material feeding cut front location this one front location right so this sensor and this sensor is to control the material feeding cut back location okay so and this sensor this sensor is to control the pellet feeder system back location right and uh, that sensor here is to control the pellet feeder system front location so it's, it's easy right and uh, there's another sensor here. This sensor. This sensor. That means uh, after this motor, right, to offload in a hook. After this motor to offload in a hook. And after this iron, go back touch this sensor. Right? So this motor will be stopped. This motor will be switched off. That's all. Okay, now I want to show you this is the block stack machine. The block stack machine, and uh, what you have to do, have to connect uh, with the stack machine is, uh, is this line sometimes. And only this, and only this cable you have to fix. You have to fix this, and this is a switch, right? It's the power switch. It's power switch. So you have you have to fix this cable, three wine together with uh, this switch so you can see this uh, this one this keyboard right here yeah okay this one this one right this keyboard is coming from the stack machine this keyboard all in this keyboard all in this keyboard is coming from the stack making machine uh, stack machine block stack machine right will be fixed here uh, same as the main power you know this one is the main power for the block machine this cable this cable is uh, is for the block making machine will be fixed together with the power switch the power switch here okay okay so and all of this uh, uh, and this connection no need to change no need to no need to do anything about this so before delivery we will fix we'll be fixed the different cable here very well so for the customer you don't need to do anything about this box okay uh, okay and also for the for the limit like this uh, limited uh, lim limited uh, switch you know we will fix the well we will fix the well and for you, you don't need to, to do anything about this, right? So like this switch, right? So after this uh, stack machine touched here, they will 
I stop, we will stop following down and we will transfer. Uh, we will go front, we will go front. And uh, this switch, right? So after this, this block, uh, block stacker, go up touch here, right? So they will stop, uh, stop and going up. They will, you know, to go front, right? And uh, after this stack machine, attach here, attach this uh, limited uh, limited uh, switch. They will not, uh, they will not go front anymore. They will drop down to stack the pellets one by one. Okay. So the stack machine is easy to be to be understand. We have to fix the for this uh, stack machine. Lag yanya. You know this one, the, the controller box of the stack machine. The controller box of the stack machine. And what you need to fix the, is this line is a number is number nine and twenty. This one, this fix. Uh, no, 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 this this keyboard. This keyboard, you know, is for connect here. It's connect. Yanya, uh, kanama. Yeah, it's here. So. And this limited uh, switch. Right? It's on the block transfer system. Block transfer transfer system. So that means uh, when the pellets come out fr from the block machine and the pellets with the blocks attach this one. Attach this limited uh, switch. So the stack machine will start working. The stack machine will start working. So this line, this line, right? This line. Will be fixed to number nine and number twenty. And later on, we will make a mark here. We will mark. We will make mark. Uh, make a mark uh, on the on the line. Okay. So you will remember. Uh, you will find out the same number connected. And uh, and this one is number one, number two, right? Number one, and number two. Okay. This line, this line, will be con connect here. Will be connect here. This, yeah, 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 it's here. But now, before delivery, after I don't know, after delivery, this line will be fixed on on here. No, we will not re release. We will not. Uh, we will not remove this line from this path. So you don't change it. So what you need to do is just uh, connect this line, and uh, together with the stack machine. Together with the stack machine here. Okay, number one, number two, number one, number two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's my idea. It's stuck machine.